Cyrus, the frightful lizard. Did I scare you? Oh yeah, I'm the dino. Ah! Look at that scary dinosaur. Run for your life. That was a close one. Let me help you say my name. Das Pleto Saurus. That's Pleosaurus. <laughs> 75 million years ago is a horror show of carnivorous monsters. But you're never going to find another scarier than me. See these teeth? These are dagger sharp, curved, and they have the same edges as saw. See? Saw? Get it? <laughs> these teeth are huge. Uh, only smaller than my future cousin, Tyrannosaurus Rex. But they're still big! Uh, like I said before, uh, my name means scary lizard. And there's nothing scarier than me. Uh, let's think of some scary animals. A lion is scary, all right. <laughs> what else? A great big grizzly bear. Those are totally scary. <laughs> you. It's my choppers as much as my size. Uh, I'm one frightful lizard, all right. I'm also hungry. Now that is scary. Hi, my name's Minmi. It's very easy to say Min Me. And welcome to the early Cretaceous period, 150 million years ago. These, these are my friends, Larry and Mo. We're very special dinosaurs called ankylosaurs. Ankylosaurs are dinosaurs that eat plants and have armored plates on our backs. And today, we're gonna have a race. Hey. What are you trying to pull? Oh, come on. With all that body armor on your back, you didn't even feel a thing. Ta-da! Now, are we gonna race or not? Sorry, all of this racing is making me hungry. What are you talking about? We haven't even raced yet. Minmies aren't very big. We're about the size of a full-grown lion. Hey, we could have raced Australia and back by now. That's where our fossils were found. It was now known as Australia, a place called Minmi's Crossing. Get ready, get set, and... Uh. Eh, I don't feel like racing anymore. You? We're not very fast anyways. Let's just go for a slow walk then. Besides, we all know who would have won. Yeah, yeah me. me. Greetings. Welcome to the late Cretaceous period, 67 million years ago, in what is now known as North America. Ah, we're all waiting for the eggs to hatch. Hi! I'm True Dawn. True Dawn. It means tooth that wounds. That's because of the very sharp teeth that I have. We're also the smartest dinosaurs around. Hey, Mr. Trudon, my friend and I have a problem. We had five seeds, I ate two, and now there's only one left. How many did my friend eat? Your friend ate two. I knew it. Hey, Percy, I told you, you owe me two seeds. <laughs> See? Super smart. I'm pretty much half the size of a human being. But since I'm a theropod like a T-Rex, I'm at the top of the food chain. Mr. Trudon, my friends and I only have this one cicade, but both want it. What do we do? Awesome, you're the coolest. Sharp teeth and very sharp toe claws. Oh, they're going to hatch. Well, it looks like we're going to have a big birthday party tonight. 
But tomorrow, they have to start learning math if they're going to be smart like me. One, two, three! Oh, hi! I'm Corythosaurus. That's Cor... Rytho... Saurus. Do you know what that means? Helmet lizard! It's because of this thing on my head! My herd and I use them to make amazing sounds! Listen! <laughs> Okay, that's not exactly what it's supposed to sound like. It must be all the dust from the volcanoes over there. Wow, what a sound! That's awesome! How come I can't make a big sound? Why can't I do it? Did you hear that? It's my herd calling. I'm gonna answer them if it's the last thing I do. What am I doing wrong? There's my herd. I wonder if they want to play with me. Hey guys, what do you say we play a game of... Whoa! Did you hear that? Did you? Oh joy! I wonder if they heard it. <laughs> Oops. Sorry to wake you. I was just so excited that I finally made the same sound as you guys. I'll be quieter. That's what I call fresh air on the open range. My name is Ineosaurus. That's i ne o -saurus. It means buffalo lizard. Did you know that I'm from what is now known as Montana? Only here, nowhere else in the world. You know, there's more to the late Cretaceous period than trees and stinky flowers. I'm a ceratopsid. That means I'm a herbivore. I eat plants. And I have a beak. And we have these big curved horns on our noses. Looks like a big bottle opener, doesn't it? Too bad there's no such thing as bottles in the late Cretaceous period. And I live in a big herd, which is great if there are any big dinos around that might be a threat. Just one of us might not be enough to scare off a big gobbler dino, even though we're six meters long and weigh two tons. But put us all together, and there is safety in numbers. And hey, if that doesn't work, there's always the old stampede! Oh yeah, so good. Love it. You should taste these plants and grass. It's so good. Oh, excuse my manners. My name is... So hungry. Oh yeah, my name is Brachiosaurus. Wow, I'm hungry. Yes, I know I don't look a kilogram over 60 tons, but I'm still growing. I'll get to be about 16 meters tall. Anyway, I think there's a forest over there I can eat. After all, I'd eat my 200 kilograms of food a day. Aren't you scared of me? All dinosaurs are scared of the Allosaurus. No, no, I'm a Brachiosaurus, a plant-eating dinosaur. I'm a herbivore. Bye. Hmm, all this talk of food is making me really hungry.
Zoo! The herd! Yay! I thought I lost you guys. Excuse me while I join my herd. Oh, I'm lost again. Hey, look, a delicious forest. Yes, there you go. Well, hello. I'm Mutaburasaurus. Yeah, see you with me. Muta Buddha Saurus, and welcome to the early Cretaceous period. Yes, I'm named after Murabura, the place where they found my fossil in what is now known as Australia. As you can see, I'm the top of my game when it comes to eating these cicad trees. But how's your honking? Bruce. He can honk louder than any Murabura Saurus around. Mm, yes, yeah, you see, we have these little honkers up here on our heads that we make our calls from. I challenge you to a honk off. A honk off, eh? Hmm, yeah, you're on. I'm a pretty big dino. I'm nine meters long. And I'm a herbivore. Not bad. But try this one. Good, that was a real good one. Uh-oh, we seem to have called the whole herd over. Well, since we're all here, why don't we have a honk along? Great idea. See you next time.